is architecture art. There's a big problem with art. <laughs> and the biggest problem with art uh, is if you go into a space and you can't touch it so that you, re you really can't can use it, it's saying that either the thing is more important than you are or the institution that, uh, that is housing, at least for the moment, that thing is stronger, th is stronger than you are. So you're there. You're there to gaze. You're there to view, and I don't. And I think in order to in order to really be with something, you have to do, do more than view it. You can view something in a magazine. Yeah. It should be a it sh it should be a, 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 a an interaction, and not you know uh, I am in front of this art and I am now letting the art seep into me. It sounds too much like religion to me, and I think art is asking to believe in the value of art. No, I think, I think you should question everything. What I want is a space that you're in the middle of. Sound is more important to me than, uh, than, than image, because image, you just see what's in front of you. Sound, if you close your eyes, you might not know where that, sa where that sound comes from. So, so being in the middle of things is, I think, one thing that, that makes architecture. But I wonder, I wonder if some other things were maybe, were maybe more important to me. Uh, Piranesi drawings, for example, were probably incredibly important to me, even though, you know, there were no built projects. But what was, what was important to me about Piranesi is that it was almost like sketching upon sketching upon sketching, almost as if he never wanted the drawing to be final. And I want architecture to bring that notion of, uh, you know, these aren't, these aren't people's spaces. These are, these are places that can be used and used differently and changed by one person after another person, colliding with another person. I think, I think you know, collision allows each person to speak up for his or herself. And that, I think, is the, the ideal kind of architecture, which is why I think I, I have a tendency to be, uh, to be a real supporter of, uh, of uh, pixels and bits and particles. That's easier to change than a plane, <laughs> than, a, than a surface. But it's an implication. You know, digital architecture is an implication that maybe things don't have to be don't have to really be surfaces. Maybe things can be exploded into uh, bits and particles and pixels. And once things get to be that state, then I think uh, you know, a person using it can start, to, can start to be an architect himself or herself. You know? Is architecture art? Uh, I hope it's not, <laughs> because then then, uh, then I'm in the I'm, then I'm in the wrong field once again, and I don't I don't know where to go. Uh, you know. uh, I think I, I think I think architect because architecture is used. Uh, I think one of the one of the great values of that is that it can possibly be misused, and once it's misused, I think the user goes one step one step further, maybe it's a mistaken step, but one step further or other than the designer, than the, than the architect.